Right guys, so three wood hitting off the floor, fairway wood hitting off the floor. A little tip while we're on some nice grass here at the Reunion Resort in Orlando. It's pretty nice, isn't it? I thought I'd just take the opportunity to get on some grass, hit some three woods and give you some advice about how you can hit them better. If you struggle with a shot like this, I think it's, I would rank it as one of the hardest shots in golf. I really would. I think there's a very small margin of error when hitting a three wood off the floor. I don't believe it's the easiest club to hit. So I might, I'm gonna give you some advice. I really am, but I tell you what, it's not the easiest club in, in the world to hit. I, I often get a little bit scared over it as well, but I know I twist it still, which is all right. So I'll give you some advice about how to hit this better, how to hit a three wood off the floor, and hopefully that'll help us. So the first thing we've got to bear in mind is how we actually make the club contact the ground. So the first thing we look at, when we look down at a three wood, it's quite daunting because straight away there's not much loft. It's a small, relatively small face, and we've got to try and hit what appears in our minds as a high shot. Well, first off, forget about trying to hit it high. Forget even that idea. Try and hit it like you're almost trying to hit it low. So almost trying to hit it low on purpose. And all we're looking at doing is making sure the base of the club decks out exactly the same time we hit the ball. So hitting, hitting the floor is not a bad thing with a, a three wood at all. We kind of want to hit level and sometimes we actually don't mind hitting down with the three wood, actually getting the club to kind of descend into the back of the ball. Um, so don't, first off, don't be scared about hitting it up in the air because as soon as we try and hit it up in the air, we lean back and we often hit way back here and the shot's horrendous. So don't worry about getting your three wood high. It will get high if you hit it well. So with relation to setup, I don't believe that there needs to be a massive adjustment. I generally play the, the ball just underneath my left kind of chest ball position. So try and get it up, up in the left hand side, not as far as driver, but up towards my, I'll do it here, up towards my left peck. But I aim then to get the bottom of the club to hit down almost into the ball and not worry about trying to get height. It's really important that. So as I set up, ball position slightly forward, I'm going to get the club to hit down and I'm not going to worry about the height at all. And straight away the strike, I've, I've hit that way off to the right, but the strike was fantastic and the club did just deck out. Sometimes I almost take a very shallow divot with a three wood off the floor. You see a lot of good players taking a very shallow divot through the ball, there's nothing wrong with that. Just realise that the three wood, you don't have to try and get high. You can hit it almost a little bit downwards and because of the design of the club, you'll still get loads and loads of height. I'm going to do that one again, ball position just forward. I'm going to hit slightly down into the ball. And the height comes from the design of the club, the speed that you're hitting it at, and the loft presented. As soon as I try and lift this up in the air, as soon as I'm going to try and get height on this, as soon as I try and actually hit this up, I'm going to hit the floor here and probably top it. I've hit that okay to be fair, but that's just because I managed to get a good connection. If that would have hit the floor at any point, that would have been horrendous. And all the other hung back, and if I would have hit the floor, it would have been horrendous. So, hit your three wood more like you're hitting slightly down into the ball, or level at least. Get the base of the club bottoming out when you hit, and do not worry about height. Height will come if you hit the ball well with a three wood. Let's go one more. bottomed out, I didn't worry about height, I'll be honest with you, I nailed it. <laughs> Let's go one more, ball position forward, not trying to get height and letting the club bottom out as we hit it. I'm going to take a divot on this one just to show you can still hit three wood while taking a divot as long as you're not trying to get it up in the air. Still hit it relatively clean. Let's go one more, last shot. I'm not used to taking a very small divot, but it's proven to you, you can do. I missed it too clean. You can take a divot, trust me. Guys, thanks so much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe by clicking the link down below. It's a three wood hitting off the floor. Don't be scared about hitting it without height. Don't try and get height. Get the club bottoming out and hitting slightly down is not a bad thing at all. Guys, thanks for watching.
comment down below. We'll see you next time.